In today's video, we're going to look at all the element variants in PVZ and finally tell you what the best one is. Starting off with number four, we have Frozen. Now, while Frozen is down this low, hear me out. While Frozen is a very good ability, since when you hit your opponents multiple times, you can freeze them so they can't use their abilities or shoot back. It's just simply too situational. It can be good if your opponent is only going to rock like Super Brains or a Torchwood or a Mech or something. But besides that, Frozen characters just don't have that much going for them. While there are really good Frozen characters like Arctic Trooper and Yeti Chomper every now and then, those two characters cannot make up for the overall faults of the variant, which is why I'm ranking it last. Now in third place we have Electric. Now hear me out. I know Electro P exists. I know chain damage is very good. But you're not always going to be in situations where electric damage can pay off. While in Turf Takeover, if enemies are in groups, you can get a lot of value because it does so much damage there. Besides that one scenario, electric characters don't really have that much going for them. And like I said earlier, while we do have really good electric characters like Electro P, it is not enough to make up for the simple situational cost that Electric generically has. And now in second place, they're going to be Toxic. While of course we also have really good characters in Toxic class, like how we have Toxic Super Brains, or we have Captain Squawk, or how we have Toxic P, it's just not enough. When an opponent takes Toxic damage, they take 2 ticks of damage every second for 5 seconds. So basically every toxic character has an additional 10 damage every single time they hit somebody. And also this does get rid of groups. So it's basically the overall better electric version. Now it doesn't have the range of chain lightning, but splash toxic damage can still be extremely effective, but it is not the best, which is why it's second. But on to first, the overall best variant, the best elemental ability in Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare is fire damage. Fire damage, if any character gets hit by it, can do a whopping 4 damage a second for 5 seconds. Which means every single character, on top of their regular damage, does an additional 20 damage. So basically, this ability can literally make anybody just that much better. Even if a character can only do 1 damage, because they have fire on them, they basically do 21 damage per shot. And there are so many good examples of characters that have this ability and it makes them so much better. Fire Flower is one of the best fire variants in the whole entire game because you are able to deal damage and also heal yourself. And even when you're a fire character and doing like 7-8 damage per pedal, you have 60 shots which can pretty much do over 20 damage for every single one. That can be an extremely huge problem. You also have characters like Fire P, which gets the advantage of having fire splash damage, which can pretty much do the job of group control or be really crazy in 1v1s. Like, fire damage is just extremely good. And while, of course, these characters are not the best of their class, like things like Electro P is better than Fire P and etc., the fact that any character that gets fire damage pretty much gets an additional 20 damage overall is just too good to be compared to anything else in the whole entire game. This is why in my opinion, without a doubt, fire damage is the best ability in the game. 